my slow cooker teriyaki pork. I start off by putting the pork into the bottom of the pot and we're going to put this on to slow cook. So that sits in the bottom there. You want around 950 grams of pork tenderloin for this recipe. In here I have 120 mils of water and we want to add in 50 grams of brown sugar. I've got some ginger diced up and you can grate it if you want. Fresh ginger is the best if you can get that. And that is three teaspoons. Now you can use fresh garlic. I'd probably put in a couple of cloves. If not, you can do as I'm doing here. And I'll go with a couple of tablespoons of garlic granules. Now we want some soy sauce and we need four tablespoons to create the sauce. So that's four in there. We want some white rice vinegar and you're going to need two teaspoons of this. You want around a teaspoon of onion powder, a teaspoon of sesame oil, and then to the sauce, I add in a tablespoon of corn flour and just give that a little mix. And that is your lovely teriyaki sauce that's going to flavour this pork and oh, it just smells so good. In an ideal world, you would marinate this overnight, but unfortunately, I haven't got that option today. Even if you can leave it for a few hours, then it's really going to help. So now we can get this onto slow cook. So let's select slow cook and I want to do mine on low. Now this is a very lean piece of meat, so it doesn't take as long to cook. It's quite annoying that it's got this on, um, on the Ninja. You can't go only lower than six hours on slow cook. The way to get around that is to press start and then go in and lower the time. So I actually want to do three hours and then you just press start and now it will let you do it. So I want to do three hours. So after three hours, we're going to then check the pork, see how it's doing. And then we're going to thicken the sauce if it needs it and then cook for another hour. So it's going to have, so we'll have four hours total. The pork has had three hours now. So I'm just going to get that out of the slow cooker just for a moment. So let's lift out the pork. It's going to have another hour still. So let's put that onto a plate. Now with the sauce, it's sort of fairly thick, but I want it a little bit thicker than this. So it really coats that pork when that is finished. So what I do at this stage is I just make up a little corn flour slurry. So we've got a tablespoon of corn flour there with a little bit of water and then just add that in. You may or may not need to do this and it's up to you. If you like the sauce, that consistency, then leave it. You don't need to, but that will really just help thicken that sauce up. And we're gonna give it one last hour of cooking pork is looking really tender and lovely so let's lower that back in and pop the lid down and carry on i'm going to get the pork out now look at this and i'm going to slice this up and look how thick and lovely that sauce is now which is great so i'm going to leave the sauce in here go and slice this up and let's get dinner served here we go so teriyaki pork slow cooked it is so tender i've served it with the sauce all over the top we've got white basmati rice on the bottom and i've just stir fried some sesame carrots and tender stem broccoli to go with it i'm really looking forward to tucking into this dinner let me know in the comments if you give it a go i hope you do and i hope you really enjoy it